Hi there, Jeffrey Rhodes from Experimental Homesteader, Exotic Gardening, and SherryAnnRichardson.com. Uh, so, yesterday after work, uh, came home, got Sherry, and we went over to her grandmother's and spent some time over there. We had uh, dinner with her. Um, I went to McDonald's and picked up some sandwiches and brought them back. Um... <laughs> <laughs> but we had a nice time. Um, and then uh, today, uh, after work, uh, Rob, one of my co-workers, uh, we went over to Sherry's grandmother's and uh, we cut down uh, the one pine tree that she uh, wanted to get rid of. Um, we made quick work of it. Uh, it was it was still fairly small, so it didn't take too long. Um, and we loaded it into uh, Rob's trailer. He was going to take the wood, you know, the trunk, and uh, probably use it for a bonfire. Because um, it, he was looking for wood for uh, a wood stove, and pine is not. A good choice for that um, but he was going to use the boughs off of it for his goats so um, so we loaded everything up um, cut it down real close to the ground so it's it's almost uh, where you can't tell that there was a tree there originally uh, and at work today it was torture um, we're having uh, barbecued pulled pork on Friday. And Caleb, the plant manager, uh, oh, about a week and a half ago, I think it was, they brought in a uh, smoker at work uh, out on the what used to be the smoke shack out front. Um, it's a covered patio area. And uh, so this morning he had started it up and he... Uh, was smoking uh, I don't know how many pounds worth of uh, pork butt and when I went into work this morning that smell just permeated the building and it was torturous um, it just smelled so good um, and when I left they were getting ready to uh, actually sit down or work on pulling the pork um they had smoked it long enough and uh, they were they had several stations set up where they were going to be uh, placing the uh, pork butts so that they could shred the, the meat and separate it out from the fat and the bone and uh, unfortunately it's not going to be until friday that we actually eat so we have another day to wait and be tortured with uh this uh, smell and, and everything for for this uh, pulled pork um, so but I think it'll be worth it those, those pulled pork, pork sandwiches that he makes are just amazing so uh, and Sherry has been working hard uh, making some uh, embroidered towels um, they're really pretty cool. Uh, she's doing a real good job. And, uh, I think that's going to do it for tonight. So, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up, thumbs down, comments below. And we will see you again tomorrow. Have a great evening.